Potter, oh Potter You saw this heart from the beginning So you put this clay in your hand Even though it was ugly and filthy You called it the best kind Yeah, you called me the best kind So I'll sing Hallelujah to the potter who came and made me new. Hallelujah to the potter who came and made me new. Thank you. So put me on your now and spin me around spin me around place me in your flame now till you can see through me and I'm ready to come out in all that was broke it won't be broken after this no not after this in all that was turned finding life again and a true friend that so happens to be a potter oh hallelujah to the potter who came and made me new hallelujah to the potter who came and made me new thank you
hallelujah to the Father. And we'll sing hallelujah to the Father who came and made me new. Hallelujah to the Potter who came and made me new. I, I look, look just like you. I just feel like in the room tonight, keep playing, keep playing. I just feel like in the room tonight, God, even if after this song is finished, I just feel that God is preparing some things in your life and you know what those things are. We all have those broken pieces, but it's been tormenting you and it, whether it's your peace, your sanity, I feel like God is saying that um, the enemy has been attacking some of you guys' minds and he's preparing your mind. He's preparing your mind right now. I just declare, bring it out a little bit. I just declare that some of you are going to sleep better than you ever slept in your life tonight as you press into this moment. I don't know who the enemy's been robbing from, from sleep and whatever it is, your peace when you're at work, whatever it is, when you're at school, whatever it is. So I don't know who you are, but even if you want to come down to this altar and just lift your hands in this moment, yeah, we're going to, yeah, we're breaking that thing off of you in the name of Jesus. He's making things new again. He's making things new again. So as they begin to play, I just want somebody to come pray with us. Come on, you made broken things new again, God. So as we begin to pray, I want you guys to just begin to believe for your own house, for your own mind, for your children's mind, whatever it is. And if this is you, I want you to come down to this altar and begin to press into this moment. Because you make broken things new again, Jesus. Oh, because you take broken things and make them beautiful. Oh, you take broken things and make them whole again. Oh, you take broken things and make them beautiful. Oh, you take broken things and put them back together again. Oh, you take broken things and make them beautiful. Oh, you take broken things and make them whole again. Oh, you take broken things and make them beautiful. Oh, you take broken things and put them back together again. Cause I'm fearfully born to be made I'm 
Hallelujah to the potter who came, made me new. Hallelujah to the potter who came and made me new. Jesus. Hallelujah to the potter who came and made me new. Hallelujah to the potter who came, made me new. Anybody in here been made new by the potter? Anybody glad that he changed you? Anybody glad that he molded you and he made you? I was reminded of a time I went to this restaurant and there was this waitress she was carrying quite a few dishes and in carrying these dishes trying to serve people she stumbled over something and everything that she had fell to the ground and it just crashed the dishes broke everywhere and all the food was scattered everywhere the look in her face of utter despair. You could just see the hopelessness and sense the disappointment. She didn't mean harm. She was just trying to carry what she thought she was supposed to carry, trying to serve others. And in the process, she stumbled along the way and everything she had in her hand. Anybody ever felt like that? Man, I'm just trying to do what I'm supposed to do and I stumble across something and everything I'm, I'm carrying just falls to the ground. And I just, as Dante was beginning to minister, minister this song and begin to release the word of the Lord, talking about the despair that is in the hearts of people there's some of you that as I begin to think about this particular moment like this waitress you didn't mean harm you weren't trying to hurt anybody but there are things that you have been trying to carry that life seems to brought a shaking and it just seems to fall to the ground and things that you hold dear are just shattered everywhere things that you've and you've, it was meant to be a blessing meant to serve and you look at a circumstance and you realize this is too big for you there's no way you can fix this anybody I believe there's something right now that's, man, I've, I'm facing some stuff that I know I can't fix this anybody ever been in that moment I don't know what to do with this there's a mess right in front of me and I don't know how to fix it everything seems to be shattered and broken into pieces but he takes broken things and he makes them beautiful he'll take broken things that I broke some unintentional some intentional but he'll take those broken things and tonight he's come to this room he's come to drive stone tonight to say I'm gonna take those broken things and I'm gonna make something beautiful out of it oh it's not over honey it's not over God says it's not over I know you have this fear in your heart but it's not over I know what looks helpless but it's not over he's the master potter he's the master at taking broken things and making them beautiful hallelujah to the potter who came
just broken things and make them beautiful Taking what the devil meant for evil Turning it around I'm Turning it around Taking what the devil meant for evil I'm Turning it around Turning it around Taking what the devil meant for evil I'm turning it around Turning it around Taking what the devil meant for evil I'm turning it around Turning it around I'm taking what the devil meant for evil I'm turning it around Turning it around I'm taking what the devil meant for evil And I'm turning it around this in my heart for somebody in this room it looked messy it looked crazy little did you know that that was a setup for God's glory that you thought the enemy was just wrecking your life but God was making you new he was making you You've had passion for an aspect of your destiny that looked like it was never going to come to pass. And you went through this hell, you went through this crazy journey, and all of a sudden that journey brought you right to the place of destiny. It brought you right to the place of purpose. And you said, God, I had to go through that hell. I had to go through that craziness. But I'm so grateful because if I hadn't had that journey, I wouldn't have this testimony. If I didn't have that journey, I wouldn't have this story. If I... Oh, he's making you new tonight, man. Your family is not going to look the same. Your financial state's not going to look the same. The way you talk is not going to look the same. Your ministry is not going to look the same. He's making it all new. He's making it new. He's making it new. He's making it new. He's making it new. He's changing the infrastructure. He's changing the mindset. He's changing the resources. He's turning it around. He's making it. I love what I just saw my sister do. 
she get up and she just start turning around. I just think about 15 people ought to prophetically just start turning around. Just start turning around. I don't know what you need to have turned. I don't know what you need to have turned. Praise the Father in this 